It can be tedious work, carefully scraping away hardened asphalt to reveal the bones of ancient animals, dire wolves, ground sloths, prehistoric horses, a baby mastodon, and others. Here's a saber-toothed cat jaw right here. The front of the mouth would be right here. More than 200 species of vertebrate animals, some now extinct, have been found at the tar pits. Chief curator John Harris oversees excavations at the pits and the adjoining Page Museum. This is a, an ongoing project, um, which fortunately we are able to do year-round because of the climate in, in Southern California. And it's also good because people coming past can see what's going on, and so they get an insight in, into how paleontologists work. Scientists say they are trying to piece together a giant jigsaw puzzle of life here between 11,000 and 40,000 years ago. One important discovery is a nearly complete Colombian mammoth known as Zed. There are smaller animals, some more complete than others, says lab director Shelley Cox. Our focus in the lab is bringing them back to life and putting them in the context of what the environment was like right here and how that animal would have, have functioned within that environment. What did he eat? Um, what does that tell us about a, a changing environment? Plant and animal remains show that this area gradually warmed after the last ice age. Lab workers say small fossils can tell us as much as the big ones. For volunteer Herb Schiff, this is a treasure hunt and each discovery is important, but one stands out for him. The most exciting thing I've worked on was um, Fluffy. And Fluffy was an animal I got to name because it took a year and a half of my life to clean him. Um, but Fluffy is a North American lion, which you can see mounted in the museum now since I finished working on him. And he came with an amazing number of uh, what we call bonus bones, bones stuck to him from all kinds of other animals. So it was a tremendously wonderful job. And now that he's mounted in the museum, I get to say, that's my animal. Excavators say that thanks to the preservative powers of asphalt, scientists continue to enjoy a remarkable window into the past of Los Angeles. Mike O'Sullivan, VOA News, Los Angeles.